Development of the 2S3 Akatsuya, Acacia, 152mm self-propelled howitzer began in 1967. It was a response to appearance of the USM-109 self-propelled howitzer. First prototypes were completed in 1968. It entered service with the Soviet Army in 1971. A first significant batch of 70 units was delivered in 1973. It was produced in large numbers until production ceased in 1993. Also it was widely exported. The 2S3 Akatsuya is currently in service with a number of countries, including Russia. The Akatsuya is fitted with the D22152mm L27 howitzer, which is a modified variant of the D20 towed gun howitzer. The 2S3 is fitted with a load assisting system. Maximum rate of fire is only 3 to 4 rounds per minute. This howitzer can fire 30 rounds in 10 minutes or 75 rounds per hour. The Akatsuya is compatible with all 152mm munitions developed for the D-20, ML-20, and D-1 towed artillery systems. These include HAFRAG, heat, AP tracer, illumination, and nuclear projectiles. Maximum range of fire with standard HEFRAG projectile is 17.4 km, maximum range of direct fire is 4 km, usually a total of 40 rounds are carried. These include 36 HEFRAG rounds and 4 heat rounds. Upgraded variant, the 2S3M is also capable of firing Krasnopol precision guided projectiles with laser guidance. These have a range of up to 20 km. Secondary armament consists of remotely controlled 7.62mm machine gun, mounted on top of the roof. The 2S3 has a crew of four, including commander, gunner, loader and driver. Two additional ammunition handlers are attached when firing ground ammunition. All welded steel armor of the Akatsuya provides protection against small arms fire and artillery shell splinters. Vehicle is fitted with NBC protection and automatic fire suppression systems. The 2S3 Akatsuya uses a modified track chassis of the crew, SA-4 Ghanif, surface-to-air missile system. Vehicle is powered by a V-59 diesel engine, developing 520 horsepower. Two self-propelled howitzers of this type can be airlifted by the N-22 military cargo aircraft. It was planned that in Russian Army service older 2S3 artillery systems will be replaced by new 2S35 Koalitsyge SV self-propelled howitzers. However by 2022 the 2S35 was not ready for production. Most likely that there was a number of technical issues with the new artillery system. Furthermore in 2022 sanctions imposed on Russia due to invasion of Ukraine. This could become a setback in the production of the new howitzer. So the 2S3 howitzer should remain in service in the near future.